If anyone's out there... Hello. If this radio signal has managed to find you, and you're listening to this... This is an SOS. Save our ship. Save our souls. I... I can't tell you where I'm at. I don't know, really. They made sure I couldn't see when they took me in. But please... Try and find me. I wasn't supposed to be here this long. Damien, if you're listening to this somehow, it is where we thought. Somewhere near the Canadian border. Washington, so... Find me. You said you would make sure I could get back out. It's... It's been a year and a half, and I pray that the only reason you haven't come is because something happened to you. Because otherwise, it means you were lying and I... You... No one needs that. Anyone, though. Please. Please. Please try to... Oh god, someone's coming. Yeah, one minute. I, I'll try and come back. If something happens and I don't, still try and find me, please. I, I don't want to be buried. May. The Reverend is calling all of us together for mid-morning worship, and well, you can't miss any more. What is that? I, it's nothing, Michael. Some junk I found in the barn. But I wanted to see what it was before the crew came to take it. Is... is that a radio? That's New World Tech May? You shouldn't have that. It's not allowed. And I don't want you getting in trouble again. After the last time, well, you know the Reverend will have your back in lashes if he sees you with that. You... you women shouldn't be touching that stuff. It's not your place. Michael. No, May. I can't. I won't break the rules for you. You've come so far since you first came to us, and not saying anything. Letting you keep that with everything that's- That's what, Michael? It's nothing. I'm not allowed to say, and I shouldn't have said anything. You'll- you'll learn with everyone else. And please, come with me. And put that back where you found it after mass. Neither of us needs the trouble. Fine. I'll put it back. Like I was going to. And no one will know I touched it. It's just junk. I don't know why you're so stressed. <laughs> See, this, this is why it's taken so long to accept you. You didn't grow up with us. You don't know our ways, May. But even you should understand that no one should be touching that shit. It's New World. Sinful. And, and you of all people. A woman who needs to prove that you understand our life. Learn your place. <laughs> don't. Don't look at me like that, May. You're wasting everyone's time by being so contrary. And we wouldn't even be having this talk if you just stopped trying to act so- Look! I'm, I'm getting up. Coming. Complacent. Just give me three minutes to make sure I look okay. Please. Then I'll come with. No complaint. Okay. Okay, May. I'll walk you there. The Reverend said he had a lot to talk about today. And I'm sure you'll be excited to hear it. Shit, shit, shit! I have no freaking idea how I didn't realize what time it was. I... Shit! If it had literally been anyone else... I have three minutes. Okay. That was Michael. The Reverend's grandson. 
he's... He's the only reason they haven't killed me by now, and I swear to God they would have if he didn't like me so much. I challenge him? That's what he said. I'm not like the rest of the girls here. They're... I don't have the time to talk about that right now, but my name isn't really May. It's Kestrel. And it's a long story of how I ended up here, and one I don't want to tell, in case Michael is still listening, but I did. If things had gone according to plan, I wouldn't still be here. But they didn't. And now... I said I didn't know where I am, and that's true, but the Reverend calls it Sapphire Springs. You might recognize the name. One of the United States' biggest and baddest religious cults. Made famous by that one dude who escaped from it. There have been several people who escaped, as far as I know, but one who went national. And pro tip, don't think of even saying his name aloud around here. But somehow, no one with an ounce of power knows where it is, aside from Washington. Except me, I guess. I have a general idea, but that's no good until someone hears this. Until I'm out, or this gets picked up by someone. Everything I've learned is useless. May, are you alright? I'm fine. Just trying to brush out my hair. One minute. No one will see it anyways, May. Come on. Michael! I'm... I'm changing too. Wait outside. I really have to go, but that's the basis. I'm stuck. And a few of the girls, and Michael, and maybe even the Reverend after my last. Although I hope to God that he doesn't. They're starting to suspect I want to get out. And the last time that happened to someone... Well, don't say her name either. Just, please, find Sapphire Springs and get me out before I'm buried here forever. Okay, Michael, I'm coming. I'll be back. I am not giving up on this radio. Sapphire Springs, episode one, Distress Call, written and edited by me, Ari Arwen. The voices you just heard were the lovely Megan Cassidy as Kestrel, and Henry at A Geek's Nerdy World on Tumblr as Michael. Speaking of Tumblr, if you'd like to hear more of us, you can follow us on Tumblr at Sapphire Springs Podcast or on Twitter at S Springs Pod, which is a weird username, I am wildly aware. Here, you'll find updates, blog posty stuff, and links to transcripts. Those are on our Tumblr. So, as always, thank you for tuning into our distress call, and we hope to see you soon.